Street. Oh, hello, dear. It is I, your furry old pal, Grover, and I am so excited. I am about to give a prize to my old friend, Froggy. But first, I will read him my poem about frogs. Oh, and they will be singing and oh, dancing. Oh, and it's going to be so much fun. I can't wait. It's so exciting. Little pigs, the three little pigs. Shh. Why are you here, Pickies? Well, because we are close personal friends of Kermit the Frog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He talked to us twice on Sesame Street News. Exclusive! <laughs> <laughs> we will bring in the prize. Yes, the prestigious new Froggy Award! The, the biggest, biggest prize a frog, frog can get! <laughs> and we'll do anything else we want. You too. betcha! <laughs> <laughs> this could be trouble! <laughs> Big control! Yeah. The big bad wolf. Yeah. Move it, swinelets, or I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your ties off. If they bother you, just <laughs> yell, Pig control! Gotcha. Pigs are my business. Right. And now, live from Kingfisher Hall in the Lincoln Center for the Performing Larks, the American Frog Institute honors its Frog of the Year, Kermit! Just keep those pigs out of my fur, okay? We are honoring a great amphibian tonight, okay? Good. We need some self affair, some grass! Hello, Froggy! Uh, uh, the name's Kermit. Whatever you say, Froggy. It is your night, and notice I am wearing my cute little tuxedo just for you. <laughs> <laughs> you, you call, call that, that a tuxedo? tuxedo? This is a tuxedo. Ladies and toads, here is my poem for Kermit. Like you, please. Thank you. <clears throat> what is a frog? Is it just some slimy little green animal that lives in a swamp and eats flies and goes a ribbit? No! Some frogs live in apartments and wear overcoats and eat fly on the mode and love their elbows. I love my elbows. Let's get straight to the point. I love my elbows. Yeah, they're my favorite joint. They bend my arm with so much charm and finesse. I love my elbows. Hey, take my ankles, please. I love my elbows. So much I'm weak in the knees. Without these two, I'd sure be blue, I confess. Yeah, thanks to elbows. I'm a fella who's got a hook for his umbrella. And for cool and casual leaning, boy, are they great. Yes, and right below my shoulders are the perfect package holders. Just use them anytime you want, or simply make them straight. I love my elbows. They really top my list. I love my elbows even more than my wrists. They're flexible and bony. They help answer the phony. They're useful when you need to touch your finger to your nose. That's right. It's true. I love my elbows. My favorite joint. No, I did not know that frogs had elbows, did you? I did. You did? 
How did you know frogs have elbows? I see a lot of frogs. Really? Mm -hmm. Would you show me your elbows? Two elbows. Wow. <laughs> Tropical island with the mango moon and banana sunshine And on this tropical island there lives a cousin of mine Sometimes he lives in the water, sometimes he lives on the land Sometimes he likes to go sun himself on soft Caribbean sand He's a Caribbean amphibian He likes to hop in the tropical sea Caribbean amphibian a frog in the coconut tree The flying fish and the turtles They've seen him hop where the pineapples grow He likes to see all the islands So island hopping he goes Sometimes he hops to Jamaica Sometimes to Haiti he hops Sometimes the warm Puerto Rico beach Is where he finally stops He's a Caribbean amphibian he likes to hop in the tropical sea, Caribbean amphibian, a frog in the coconut tree. Sometimes he lives in the water, sometimes he lives on the land. Sometimes he likes to play music with an old amphibian band. He's a Caribbean amphibian. He likes to hop in the tropical sea, Caribbean amphibian. A frog in the coconut tree, everybody! Caribbean amphibian. He likes to hop in the tropical sea, Caribbean amphibian. A frog in the coconut tree. A frog in a coconut tree. Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit. Pardon me! Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit. Is a frog. Like you. Thank you. A frog. Is he merely a green creature with big bulgy eyes like ping pong balls? No! He also has big floppy ears and a long nose. Yes. And teeth. Lovely white teeth, as we all know. Or I should have them. Oh, but wait, let me show you on this thingamajig here. I do not believe this. I do not believe it. <sighs> Isn't tight. Aha! Uh, uh -huh. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> As I said, a, a, a froggy has no ears and no nose, but, but he does have calmness. Yes, he never gets angry or yells. Will you get out? Ah! I'm Kermit the Frog, and I told you I want my Kermit the Frog t shirt. You don't I, have to come in here I and try to sell me a nose runner because I do not have a nose. Grover, I'm going to get you for this guy. What I meant to say is, um, um, <clears throat> what is a frog? Someone with no ears and no nose who gets angry and yells sometimes. But of this I am certain. A frog knows the alphabet. <clears throat> a, B, C, T, E, L, G, H, I, Oh. 
amazing, beautiful creatures dancing excite the forest glade. In my heart, how I do jump like the hoodoo, listen to the music so nice the organ played. Quietly rest the sleepy tiger under the vine tree at the waterside, and X marks the place neath the yellow moon where the Zulu chief and I did hide. Gumnandi, Gumnandi, where the Gitanamji? Ipiman. Can you sing the alphabet, Joey? Yes, yes, I could. Let's hear you sing the alphabet. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Can you sing the alphabet? Yes, yes, I could. Let's hear you sing the alphabet. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U Cooking monster is in the letter of the alphabet. It goes Q R S T U V. You're you're just teasing me. W X Y and Z. Now I know my A B C's. Next time, Cookie Monster. Next time, Cookie Monster can do it with you. I'm leaving. I love you. I love you too. Thanks. I don't know how to fly. My, my. High up in the sky. High, high. A frog is what I am. Yes, ma'am. I'm happy as a clam. Flam, flam. Cause there's one thing I can do. do. Come on and do it too. Sing just like a lark. Don't stop. I can't move like a cow. How? How? 'Cause frogs just don't know how. Wow! Wow! But there's one thing I can do. Do. And you can do it too. Do. Come on, it's keen. Don't need to be green. Do up, do up, hop. Do up, do up. A tree. So sad. I'm not a chimpanzee. Too bad. Since I was a pollywog. Young tad. Been proud to be a frog. Good lad. 'Cause there's one thing I can do. Do. Come on and do it too. Do. There's nothing ever get down on one feather and do up, do up. Life is not, not always. always. Pick control. <laughs> Never mind. Life is not always hunky dory for a froggy. But when he is sad, he never gets the blues. He gets the greens. It's not that easy being green, having to spend each day the color of the leaves. When I think it could be nicer, being red or yellow or gold or something much more colorful like that. It's not that easy 
being green. It seems you blend in with so many other ordinary things. And people tend to pass you over because you're not standing out like flashy sparkles in the water or stars in the sky. But green's the color of spring and green can be cool and friendly like and green can be big like an ocean or important like a mountain or tall like a tree when green is all there is to be it could make you wonder why but why wonder, why wonder, I'm green, and it'll do fine, it's beautiful, and I think it's what I want to be. What kind of weather do froggies like? They like water. Yeah, but do they like snow or rain or sunshine? I don't think they like snow. No, why not? They do not ski? <laughs> well, I ski, but sometimes they can get hidden in the snow. Uh-huh. Like, you know what, what an avalanche is? No. Well, it's when something wild um, happens and snow falls down. Yes. Um, frogs are very little, so they can get hidden in the avalanche. That is why froggies do not like snow. Mm-hmm. That's oh. why most of the time they stay in water. If they stay in water, they can freeze. So maybe they like sunshine. Yeah. Uh, uh, hark, I wonder whom that can be knocking upon my door. I will go to the door and see. Mm. Hello there, Mr. Frog. I represent the little Wondro Machine Company. May uh, I have a moment of your time, please, sir? Uh, Gro Grover, is that you? Uh, yeah, it is me, Froggy. I didn't know you were a door-to-door -door salesman. <sighs> well, you know you got to do something to pay the cookie bill. Uh, I, I suppose so, but... Yeah, just uh, put this on the uh, table it, right here and put what this is down. That, what is that it thing is there? It's a nice little table. Grover, mm -hmm. what are you selling? Oh, this here. I am selling weather. Weather? Weather. With this little machine, uh, weather. Gro Grover, weather is not something you sell. Weather is something that happens outside, like the sun shines or the clouds come. But <laughs> weather is not something you sell. Ha, ha, ha. That is a good one, Foggy. <laughs> Why <laughs> is that a good one? But you see, all my customers say that, and it is not true. With this little Wondro machine, I can give you weather in your own home. Yeah, we'll turn it on. Weather in my home? Yeah. For instance, what if you would like snow? Huh? Snow for only a dollar in your own home. You can get this lovely snow. It is beautiful. It is white. It is. It is uh, the thing you want for your hey, own wait a minute. home. When Grover, Christmas comes, Grover, for Santa Claus. Grover, it's snowing. It's snowing in the living room here. Oh, well, I don't want snow in the living room. Well, then some people may not want snow in the living room. So I don't like snow in the win, living room. Win. Grover, wind is ah! wonderful. It is only fifty cents. Grover, it cleans the air. It is all wonderful when the, the trees and leaves Grover, rustle. Grover, I don't want any wind either, Grover. Some frogs may not want wind. Either. Like me, I don't want wind in here, Grover. So for those people, we give them rain. Rain. Oh, wonderful rain. The rain is good Grover. for little flowers that grow. Wait a minute, Grover. Little bunny rabbits get a bath in Grover, it. Grover, hmm? listen, I don't want your snow. I don't want your wind. I don't want your rain. I want you out of here and stop wrecking my place. Oh, oh okay. But Gro Grover, wait a minute, mm -hmm. what about the rain here? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, little froggy, today you are in luck. I'm in because, luck? Because, yes, Not today, I'm today luck. I have for you an umbrella for only $7. $7? Make it a nickel. Here's a nickel. Oh, oh, thank you, froggy. A but nickel, my first nickel. I make, I got a deal. Oh, I got a deal. Oh, mommy, I made a sale. Mommy, I made a sale. Thank you, froggy. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. oh. I did 
no, no pigs could tie knots. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is, is a frog? frog? Someone, Someone green, green and smooth, smooth with no oh. snout or curly tail Give me that who started stuff. out Give as me. a tiny wriggly tadpole Pig control! <laughs> Do you know that Kermit is getting an award? No. Yes, the Frog of the Year Award. I saw a picture of, I think, um, Kermit and the award. Yes? Mm-hmm. Do you think he deserves it? Yeah. Why? Because he's like the only frog who can act, and he's mostly the only frog who wears clothes, and the only frog who talks. Good enough for me. Mm-hmm. Hi there. You know what's down there in this pond? Tadpoles. Mm -hmm. Tadpoles. Baby frogs. Tadpoles. Wiggling in the water, brand new world is there for you to see. Lots of time till you grow up to be a big frog like me. Tadpole, haven't got to worry, biggest job is swimming peacefully. Wonder if you know you'll grow to be a big frog like me. Changes happen as time passes by. Soon enough you'll be grown with a home on a lily pad and some tadpoles of your own. Oh, little tadpole, wiggling in the water, far from all responsibility. Take your time till you grow up to be a big frog like me. Tadpole, take your time to be a big green grown-up frog like me. Hey, you know, Kermit the Frog is on Sesame Street. Do you know what job he does as an amphibian? You know what job he does? Um, yeah. What? Um, he's like a news person. Yes! And you know what he says as a news person? Um, not really. I'll whisper. He goes, hey ho, Kermit the Frog here. Can you do that? Hey ho, Kermit the Frog here. Excellent! We take you now to Kermit the Frog with another fast-breaking news story. Hi ho, this is Kermit the Frog speaking to you from the scene of the accident. Hi ho, Kermit the Frog here for Sesame Street News. Hi ho, Kermit the Frog here. Speaking of, for all the egg lovers of the country, I want you to know it's very nice to have you back. <laughs> Hey, wait a minute, oh, where are you taking me? Bruce? Listen, I can you explain can this whole thing weekends. away. Oh, wait a minute, I came here to meet Peter Piper. I've met Porter Piper, Potter Piper, Piper Piper, Papa Piper, Pepper Piper, Porker Piper, and Parker Pepper, all picking peppers. Now, where is Peter Piper? Ah, he's in Portland, pressing pants. Oh, I'm not Cinderella, she's, she's inside the house. Oh, 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 then I ate airplanes and I put the sun in my pocket. <laughs> Hey, Mumford, look what you did to me. Oh, no. Oh, folks, this is Kermit the Frog re returning it to our... Returning it to you. Uh, 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 <laughs> uh, this is Kermit the Frog, and I'm, I'm being, <laughs> being followed by Mary's little lamb and uh, returning you to your regularly scheduled... Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, this is Kermit the Frog returning you to your regularly scheduled program. This is embarrassing. You think this we can do anything about it? No, no, no. What kind of food do they serve there? What? Is a frog? He is not a monster. We cannot all be monsters. He is just a green, friendly animal with a collar, but no shirt, and bulgy eyes, and floppy arms. Who's proud to be that way? 
Dip. A frog behind a desk doing office work? <laughs> This frog has to go his own way. This frog doesn't care what the other frogs say. This frog wants to be happy. And this frog has to try. This frog is gonna make it or no. The reason why I'm not gonna sit here Like some dumb old bump on a log That isn't me I'm gonna be this frog This frog has a song to be sung. This frog isn't gonna spend his life in a swamp catching flies with his tongue. This frog may slip and stumble, but this frog tries again. This frog never will grumble, but fall. Frog of the month! 
and it's Whoa. June and July. The frog and the million, the ribbit we seek. The frog of the man and the day, month, and week. If you're of those froggies, Whoa. it's perfectly clear. You must be the frog of the year. He wanted to thank his mommy and daddy and Sesame Street News, the frogs in the Glen, the little people behind the scenes, the big people behind the scenes, and someone called Jim. You must be the frog. 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 Be the frog. <laughs> you okay, froggy? Do what? Do what? at www.sesamestreet.com. 